We're opening up Friday night in Lawrence, Dominican Republic versus Puerto Rico. That atmosphere, that ballpark is gonna be packed. I'm talking about packed. We're gonna have we're gonna have a live commentator there. We're gonna have music. We're gonna have food. They, I want the people to to enjoy the culture and understand the culture. We're gonna learn each other's culture in this. You're gonna see the passion that Dominicans and Puerto Ricans bring to the game. You're gonna see the love of the game. The fans are there cheering, having a great time, playing music, eating. Some are gonna probably be drinking. You know, you don't know. It's gonna be a great time. And, and that's why I did this tournament is because I want everyone to experience everyone's different culture. And at the same time, having a healthy competition, you know? It, it, it's, it's, oh, Dominican Republic won the championship. United States won the championship this year. You know, it's, 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 it's a pride thing. You're playing for your country. It's not just about you anymore. It's about your country. So people are going to come out supporting their country. And you're going to see how in a city like Lawrence, Massachusetts, baseball is huge. And the Latin community is even bigger. So what we're trying to do, like I said, we're trying to change the game, change the way baseball is being played out here. Right now, you go to a baseball game, maybe you see two or three people watching. This tournament is going to change that. You're going to see people out. We're going to bring people out. And for people watching, bring your people out. For the USA team, and you're going to play in Lawrence, bring your fans out. Bring your family out because they're going to have their family and friends there. In Somerville, Saturday night, we got a DRPR game too. We're going to do the same thing we did Friday. We're going to do a Saturday night in Somerville. So you're going to experience it in, in, in Lawrence, and then you're going to experience it in, in Somerville, you know? And it's just going to be something beautiful because we haven't had something like this. You only hear about the Spanish um, culture. You only hear about the American culture. You don't really experience it until you go through it and you see it with your eyes, you know? The USA teams, they got something to brag about when they play each other. We're the better USA team, you know? You don't want, oh, I lost to Team Blue. We're, they're the real USA team. Well, I lost to Team Red. They're the, you know, like, you, it's a pride thing. You want to beat. And I think this is why everyone's excited, because they get to represent something more the bigger than them, you know? They represent in their country. And, and as corny as some people, oh, no, it's not, it's not just amateur baseball. This is what we do. Most of the people that play love this. Besides their family, work, and things, this is, this is what we do. This is what we love. So it's, it's a prideful thing, and that's what I think, that's why there's so much excitement. Because people are excited to to represent their country, you know, and to be on top and say, we're the best. You know what I'm saying? And that's what it's about. I could sit here and say, Dominican Republic is the best country in the world when it comes to baseball. And I'm half Puerto Rican. I could say the same thing about Puerto Rico. Or, you know what I'm saying? Or I could, I'm going to have an interview with a couple of players. They're going to say the same thing about their country. You know? No disrespect. Everybody thinks they're the best. Now you now you get on the field and, and play it out. So you comes on top.